Hey guys, welcome to Ryan's TV. I'm Ryan Senokta. Look at this place, it's a beautiful place, right? So it's March 7th, Saturday. As you guys know, since the Universal Studio is closed from February 29th, 2020 to March 15th, I think after they opened it, the Universal Studios never closed. I was wondering if the Universal Studio closed, how the Universal City Walks looks like? And then will there be people? Because you know, it's a Saturday. So in this video, I want to show you how the closed Universal Studio looks like. So I'm here with my motorbike. From now, I'm gonna go to the Universal Studios by motorbike. Speaking of my motorbike, it's a 50cc scooters. In Japan Roll, you can't go over 30 km per hour, so it's gonna be a slow trip. So right now, I am at the Yamatogawa, which is really south part of Osaka. Alright, so anyway, let's go to Universal Studios Japan. Ryan's TV Alright, so let's go! I'm at Tennoji right now. Yes, that's the tallest building, Abeno Harukas. All right, so the next, let's head to the Benten Cho and Universal Studios Japan. So let's keep going. Finally, I get to the Taisho area. You see huge intersection over there, right? Still, I have to keep straight, but I think it's only 20 minutes from here to the Universal Studios Japan. So let's keep going. All right, here I go. Finally, we arrived to Universal Studios Japan. So let me park my motorbike here. So this is a place that you can park motorbike. So since this place, first three hours, it's free parking. So in Saturday, it's kind of hard to find a parking spot. However, as you can see, there are no motorbike parking and made a bicycle. <laughs> yeah, I've never seen like this. Uh, it is really interesting. You see the guitar over there. Wow, it's still lighting. So let's go to check the Universal Japan City Walk. It's just over there. So let's go up. All right, so let's go. <laughs> okay. So let's see if there are people or not. Oh, actually, you know what? Still, there are people. And there is music too. Very interesting. I thought the Universal City Walk will be totally closed. Seems like still many restaurants open. So seems like Universal City Walk opens. However, as you can see, the Universal Studios Japan, the gate is closed. Well, so unfortunately, you can't take a picture in front of Universal Globes. Wow, it is really interesting. So anyway, let's go to check the Universal City Walk. Wow. 
you know, it's kind of a weird feeling because there is music and then it's a Saturday night. However, yeah, as you can see, really few people here. But one thing amazed me is that still there are people. I thought it's gonna be no people, like literally no people. But uh, seems like not, huh? So let's see if some store or restaurants are opening. So that's the Universal Studios new section, the Mario World. Well, I heard it's gonna open this summer. So I'm pretty sure that Universal Studio didn't expect this situation. So I hope the situation gets better before the Mario section opens. Anyway, so let's keep checking. Nice. Still, Lawson opens. And how about the Starbucks right next to Lawson? Oh, Starbucks opens as well. Interesting. So how about Universal City Walk Restaurant Street? Oh my goodness, it's start raining right now. Well, hopefully it stops. Anyway, let's go to check the Universal City Walk Food Street. One thing I realized that there are people, <laughs> sweet, <laughs> they wear the suits. There is a hotel. I believe they had the wedding or something in the hotel over there. So that's why uh, many people are still here. Seems like TGIF still opens. And then what else? The gap is closed. Wow, I didn't expect that Takoyaki Park is open. <laughs> Interesting. All right, so let's see what else they still have. Well, seems like Hard Rock Cafe is still open, and then they are having party over there. Oh, this escalator is not working, but the one over there is working though. It's kind of weird. I guess so. The third floor closed. Anyway, so let's see. Well, seems like pretty much all restaurants in this floor closed. But that's what I thought. Still, Saizeria opens. However, less people though. So this is how the Universal City Japan City Walk looks like. Yeah, McDonald's is closed. Many other restaurants is also closed. However, still there are many restaurants opens. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, still many people here, but of course it's much less than usual though. Yes, it's 6.30 p.m. Saturday night, but you know Universal Studio is not open, so it makes sense. Hotel still open, so that's why the convenience store is open as well. <laughs> you know what, I'm kind of hungry, so let me grab something from the convenience store. Oh, uh, it's still raining. Oh, by the way. I get the dots from the convenience store. Anyway, let me find a place to shoot the ending. You know, since outside it's raining, so I think this is a good place to shoot for the ending. And also, let me show you guys what I bought. Oh my goodness, this place is super noisy. 
Hope you guys can hear my voice. This is the thing I bought. I was hungry. So this is the Nameko Biso Soup. Actually, you can get the hot water from the convenience store. You know, outside it's pretty cold and I still have to drive my motorbike, so... There is tiny mushroom here. And I bought the onigiri. It's beef yakiniku. It's 150 Japanese yen. By the way, I already cleaned my hands by this hand wipe, so I think should be fine. Mm. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, oh, she. I love convenience stores onigiri. Especially this yakiniku taste. This is how it looks like. There are not so much meat, but uh, perfectly matches with white rice. This yakiniku taste. You know what? I think this place is too noisy, so let me move to some other place. Oh my goodness, look at outside. Yes, it's still raining. You know, I came here by motorbike, so I have to wait until the rain stops. So, uh, I think I can shoot the ending when the rain stops. Well, let's see how long I have to wait. Now it's 7 16, so hopefully before 9. Anyway, so let's wait. All right, so I came back to the place where I parked my motorbike and move my motorbike under the roof. Actually, there are two reasons that I move my motorbike. The one, the free parking is only for three hours. So if I park it more than three hours, I have to pay money. And then two, I don't want to make my motorbike wet when I get home. So <laughs> definitely, I didn't expect this situation. Well, hopefully rain stops. All right, so let's wait here. All right, so it seems like rain has stopped. Hopefully, won't rain again. Oh, well, you know, it's because it would take like an hour to go home. Oh, anyway, speaking of myself, I usually make a Osaka and Tokyo travel guide and a good and the inexpensive restaurant guide videos. So if you are planning to traveling to Japan or you like Japan, please check my other video and please subscribe to my channels. It will really encourage me to keep shooting videos. Hope this video was interesting for you. Thank you so much for watching my videos. So see you in the next video. Arigato. Bye bye.